Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I have here a couple of uh, cute teeny mini loaded envelopes and I made the uh, envelopes using this die that I've got here that I purchased online and it's a really cute die and it is it is quite small so when you cut it out it uh, looks like that and it also comes with uh, some score lines for you uh, so when you assemble the envelope it gives you a guide of where to fold it so I will put the details in the bottom for you if you would like to purchase one of these um, so what I might do is I'll assemble one and show you how it looks like and then I will show you what I've got inside the um, teeny envelope so um, as you can see there's some score lines here and you just fold it over just like that and on the sides and I'll just apply a bit of glue um, yeah sorry it's that way I'll just apply I'm sorry I'm just gonna say I think it goes on like that yeah so that's how your envelope looks like I'll just put a bit of glue here on the um, shorter end of the flap just here and that's the bottom and I'll just fold that over so then you can get to see what size it is and then that one just folds over like that so that is a really tiny envelope as you can see it's got a nice little spot in there to add a little note or a little gift so yeah so that is the envelope size and these are what I've put, I managed to put inside the little teeny envelopes. And these are little, uh, what do you call, uh, little loaded envelopes that I'm going to um, send off to a couple of my swap partners that are on Instagram. So this one here, I've got it, I've got the front of the envelope embellished with a uh, cup, cupcake liner that I made. And there's a little ephemera there. I added one of my altered paper clips using my scrap papers. So I added one of them. I've added a couple of dies, or die cuts, I should say, that I've die cut. Um, I die cut it and stamped a sentiment. Um, just a little tag. I made a little pack of. Uh, die cut uh, bows inside my little package there I also added an embellished handmade tag that I made and she can write something on the back there if she wants to wants to um, send it off to somebody else so and that's the envelope so yeah that's what I've put in here so it's just another little gifted item I wanted to add to the uh, into the happy mail so that's one I'll just put these back in here so I don't forget so you know it does uh, it does store a couple of few items in there which I think is pretty cute so that's that one and this is the other one and this is a little embellished sentiment that was gifted to me by one of my pen pals and again I just used one of my cupcake liners to create this rosette and again I've just added a little altered paper clip using my scraps and again some die cuts as well in there a little die cut a stamp sentiment and also another little packaged um, goodies and also um, a tag as well that I made so that one goes in there and then I'm just going to package the loaded pocket or loaded teeny envelope so it's ready to be gifted out to my pen pals so what I've got here 
I've got my clear seal bags, or well, they're clear self seal bags, and I've cut out some backing paper just to put inside the seal bags. So I'll just slide that in like that. Actually, I might add I might add some washi to the. Excuse me, one second. Sorry. I like adding washi to the packaging just to give it um, a bit more decoration. So let me just place it here first. So I might just add some washi. Some scissors. Sorry. Just cut that out. Okay, so that's one. I'll just cut that one's for that one. And then I'll cut the next one. I usually just add it to the bottom. Um, I think that's enough, otherwise it'll look too busy. I mean, you can, if you want, add another one on the top, but I'll just keep it like that. Okay, so I'll just place that in there. And it is, I always like to have the seal, the opening at the bottom instead of the top, in case I want to put a bag topper on the top, then they could just take it out from the bottom. And then I'll just slide that in there. Oops, let me just fix this up, sorry. Okay. There we go. And I'll just seal that up. Okay, that's one package done. Looks pretty, doesn't it? Once it's packaged, it just gives it a nice finished um, uh, layout for them when I open it. So that's another one. I'll pop that in there. Just let me just fix this up a little bit. That in here. And that's the other one done and these are ready to go with the flip books that I made. And I will show you the flip books on my next video that will be going with these package items as well. So yeah I just wanted to show you a little another gifted way you can send off to your uh, pen pals or your swap groups and just to see that this little tiny envelope can still manage, manage to fit a few little items in there and um, yes yeah, so I just wanted to share that with you and I will put the details below for this envelope die for you if you're interested in purchasing one and um, I hope you enjoyed my video and again I will uh, show you the flip books that I've made to go with these uh, little goodie bags on my next video so thank you for watching. Bye for now.